we're going to go through what we call shooting progression. I want you to go toe in step relationship, spread your feet apart, shoulder width apart. I want you to swing your shooting arm. Okay? When I say cock and lock, I want you to cock and lock it right in the shooting position. I want you to bend your knees and you're going to check and see if that string goes through your hand, through your elbow, through your knee, through your toe. Okay? Cock and lock. Okay? Check. Bend, bend your knees, bend your knees. Make sure that wrist, you got wrinkles in your wrist, you got your elbow above your knee, above your toe. Elbow above your knee, above your toe. Really good. Sometimes when we're little, we're not real strong yet. We want to keep that thing tucked in like a chicken wing. And then we come up and we push out. Get that elbow in front so that it's a shot, not a push. If your elbow is behind your wrist, see how Maddie's wrist is in front of her elbow here? This is a push. If your elbow is in front of your wrist, it's a shot. Okay? Wrist in front of elbow is a push. Elbow in front of wrist is a shot. See the difference? Okay? We want shots. We don't want pushes. We want shots. Okay? Got it? Now you're going to add your book in. Fingers to the sky. Okay? And when I say shoot, you're going to go up to the cookie jar. Reach as high as you can. Go all the way up on your toes. Reach your hand inside the cookie jar. Book in goes at least to your forehead, maybe a little higher, fingers to the sky, and you hold it right there. Ready? Shoot. Good. Nobody made any. Typically when we shoot, we say swish because that means it's going in. Okay? You guys were 0 for 7, I hate to tell you. Okay, you're here. Retrace. Go right back where you came from. Just like rewind on your TV. Okay, ready? Shoot. All the way up. Up high, stretch out. Exaggerate your follow through. Retrace. Right back down, bend your knees, shoot. Anybody ever going to make one? Retrace, shoot. Yes. Hallelujah. We learn slow, but we learn. Retrace, shoot. Good. Retrace, shoot. Good. Retrace. Okay, I want you to think this time about 60 degrees. When you follow through, you don't want it to be on top of your head, and you don't want it to be out in front of your face. You want it to be at about 60 degrees, so think about the angle of that follow-through. Retrace, shoot. Swish, retrace, shoot. Retrace, you guys are the most polite makers I've ever heard. Shoot, there we go, I got a little, little enthusiasm in it. Retrace, shoot. Good, retrace, shoot. Retrace and relax, all right. Can you do this at home? Can you do this at home? Can you do this if you don't have a basketball? Can you do this if you don't have a gym? Okay, this is one of the most effective things you can do as a shooter is this, and you don't need anything. You have everything you need right now. You don't need a ball, you don't need a gym, you don't need a goal, you don't need anything. You can do it in your bedroom, you can do it in your living room, you can do it in the hallway at school, wherever you want, you can do this. Try it, Maddie. It's a real guy magnet. Try it at school, I'm telling you. Okay, all right. So that's muscle memory pattern. The more you do that, the more your body thinks that. Okay? So you want to do it over and over and over so you could do it in your sleep.